almost cathartic. It's doing one little thing, the only thing that you can do, but it probably helps them feel better as well as helping the family. What started off as Tracy Seymour selling protective face masks and scrub caps for nurses during the pandemic has now grown to include embroidering t-shirts and hats as a way to rally support for a family in the Levant community after a fire destroyed their home. We've always had that strong need to help people. Um, so whenever something like this uh, strikes a community, it really strikes home. Partnering with her husband, Jason, they got the operation up and running in just 24 hours. I just wanted to do something for the family. I just wanted to do something to show that we are all in this together because it could be, it could have been us. The family is currently embroidering t-shirts that say Levant Strong as well as ball caps that say Community Strong. I was thinking Levant Strong, but I'm, Maine is a community in and of itself. And I wanted something that, say, somebody from Bangor or somebody from Portland could buy and be like, we're supporting this family. The Seymour say that while the fundraising is important, they're also just trying to let the family that they are not alone. I mean, it's not the fact that we're selling hats or that we're selling t-shirts, because that's, that's, in the grand scheme of things, that's minor. Uh, it's the fact that the community is coming together as a whole to help, but it's nice to know that we come together in times like this. And if you're interested in buying apparel, you can actually buy one of these t-shirts for $13 and nine of the dollars will actually go back to the family. Or you can buy one of these hats for $20 and more than half will go back to the family. Reporting for Levant, Matthew Jaroncic, ABC7 and Fox 22.